I am Guy Sormand. I'm a uh, French and what we call a French public intellectual. I was trained initially as an economist and I was a professor of economics at Paris University during many years. But I also uh, traveled a lot and gave a lot of lectures all around the world. I am optimistic by definition. I mean, I've chosen to be optimistic because it's so easy to be pessimistic. It's very easy uh, because, you know, when things turn bad, you can always say, I told you so. <laughs> I think I have good reasons to be optimistic because when I look, you know, at my own life, I mean, uh, I, I was born, you know, during the Vichy regime under a, a fascist state and they, my parents, you know, my father fled the um, the Soviet Union and then he fled the uh, Nazi Germany and then he went to France. So if I compare my life to the life of my parents, uh, we live in a much more liberal, tolerant and, and open society. And uh, of course, I mean, they, there are contradictions within this society. But I think if you look at the long-term trend, um, liberalism is the way because that's what basically people want. You know, when you see revolution, rebellion, protest all around the world, you know, what do people want? They want democracy, they want freedom, they want individual liberty. So I would say that the people are with us. Democracy is a revolving door. So democracy works uh, because uh, when you are in the opposition, you know that someday you'll be back in power. When you're in power, you know that someday you'll be back in the opposition. And this makes um, democracy acceptable, because even if you don't like the government, I mean, you know that this government sooner or later will go away. Um, so if you lose the election, and the socialists have lost the election, okay? Pedro Sanchez has lost the election with a small mm -hmm. margin, but always a small margin. So when you lose the election, you just go away. That's the definition of what democracy is about. It says, I go away, I, I'm, I'm losing, I'm in the opposition, which is a very legitimate position, and maybe someday I will come back. And to cling to power is really the negation of, 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 of democracy, and uh, I hardly understand that. This is, again, what we call a tragedy, which means there is no solution. There's absolutely no solution. Everybody is responsible. Uh, some are more responsible than others. But I, I, I just want to stress the responsibility of the European Union. We are pouring billions in Gaza. We send billions to Gaza. Did we ever check where the money was going? Uh, did we ever ask ourselves, are we improving the life of the people in Gaza? Of course not. Of course not. So um, if everybody is responsible, I think the European Union also has some kind of responsibility uh, by pouring so much money in Gaza without checking where the money went. And of course, the, way the money went into the pocket of the, of the barbarians because the barbarians at Hamas were, enough, were in charge. So they just took the money and build the military power than we see now.